What does Brexit mean to you? Brexit for me is like waking up in the morning with a big hangover with a very strong sense that you've done something terrible. Yeah. <laughs> I'm Alex, I'm 22 years old, from London, and I'm fourth year European studies in Maastricht. I was the only, uh, only student in my sixth form class that went abroad. Uh, everybody thought I was completely insane. I left a month before my 18th birthday. I had a backpack with just clothes in and a little package my mum gave me and I just left. Brexit was something that I was, I was vehemently against and I still am. I've had a really, really good experience here and I'm going to be really miffed if other people younger than me, I won't be able to go and tell them, yeah, go to, the, go to Maastricht, go to Europe to study because it's the best experience that I've had. Every part of Brexit for me was just people who were terrified of, of the world and being involved in it and, and other cultures, basically. Uh, we live in a time where politics has become just a spectacle to distract uh, away from yeah, basically massive increases in inequality that um, are not really, they're not really, they're, they're highly unnatural, like it's a dysfunction of uh, our economic system. It's a lot of like, uh, sort of like finger pointing by the elites, like look at the immigrants, it's them, they're coming to take your jobs. This huge fear of European free movement, we think it's going to be the Syrians or the Eastern Europeans coming across and stealing our jobs. Well, the people who use it the most are actually the educated, liberal, yeah. kind of middle class. The fact that we are living in Maastricht in itself yeah. is a quality <laughs> of our character. We are the globalised population. <laughs>